What's up, y'all? It's Jonathan Rollins. I'm back with another reaction to a Swedish classic. Before we get started, I gotta remind you about my comedy club, The Laugh House. Go to thelaughhouse.se to see what we got going on. There's only a few more shows left, so come laugh with your boy. Say hello if you come to a show. Also, I'm gonna be in uh, Uppsala on Wednesday, December 7th, and I'll also be in Velling B on Thursday, December 8th. You can get all the information at my website, bashsteadandentertainment.com. And also, I got four podcasts. I've got Sova Henda, Teach Me Sweden, Sven FL, and Perfecta Parit. Check those out wherever you get your podcasts. And now for today's reaction. Today I'll be reacting to Here We Go by Staka Bu. A little bit about the song, it was released in 1993 on the album Supermarket. One of my favorite places, huh? I used to hang out with my mom at the supermarket when I was a kid. That was kind of our bonding. You know, she was teaching me how to, how to cook and how to shop for food. The song was apparently a big hit all over Europe. It made the top 10 in Austria, Ireland, Iceland, Norway, Switzerland course Sweden and in Sweden it made it up to the number four spot I saw that the genre of the song is jazz rap uh, I don't know what that is and I'm also wondering how that could be so popular because uh, jazz rap sounds like some obscure type of music but it made it work I guess Stockable's real name is Bo Johan Renk and uh, this reaction video is being released on December 5th which is his birthday so that's pretty cool Happy birthday to you, Stockable. I guess this is my present to you. I'm doing a reaction video <laughs> to your song. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I, I hope I like the song. Man, that would suck if on your birthday, I don't like your song and I make it known. But you know, that's what this channel is, man. Welcome, enjoy your birthday. <laughs> the album Supermarket was Stockable's biggest commercial success. He recorded music between 1993 and 2001. Fun fact, Stockable directed the music video to this song. It's pretty cool. He must have liked it because he worked on more video media later in his life. He had a film at Sundance Film Festival, very popular film festival. Uh, then he went on to direct some episodes of Breaking Bad. He directed some Walking Dead episodes. He directed Bates Motel episodes. Holy crap, this is some like big deal stuff right here, man. This Swede was in the big leagues or is in the big leagues. When I hear jazz rap, um, I think of Diggable Planets. That comes to mind right away. Uh, so I'm gonna have to guess that this song goes something like, here we go, here we go, here we go now. Here we go, here we go, here we go now. <laughs> I don't know. But it's time to find out. I got the lyrics right here so I can read along as I listen. I grabbed the music video that was directed by him so we can enjoy that at the same time as well. So let's do it. Here's Here We Go by Stakabo. Cool. I like the little flute that's coming in and out. That's really nice. Uh, the lyrics are, you know, they're kind of basic, but this was 1993, so I mean, what else you want? 
It's crazy that it's nice. It feels a little uh, ahead of, of, of 1993, a little bit. I wouldn't have been surprised if this was uh, 2000s. So uh, that's that's pretty cool. That's a good that's a good sign right there that they're a little bit futuristic in their sound, uh, and it seems like there's a message behind the song too. So uh, that's cool as well. Let's keep going, man. I'm liking it so far. I like the lyrics. I don't like the uh, arrangement of them. I like the message, I should say. I like the message more than the lyrics. The lyrics are really, that's the one thing that is like 1993. So that didn't like age well as far as rap has gone since then, but you can't blame them for that. But yeah, this is uh, it's really cool. And then the dancer in the background is getting it, boy. <laughs> All right, so that was Here We Go Again by Stockable. Really cool song. I like the, the chorus of it. Like I said, the lyrics are a little aged a little bit, but it was a cool video too, the parts that I saw. At the end, they were just basically, they didn't do a third verse. I could have used a third verse, especially when they had something to say. But I guess they ran out of what they had to say about it, so they're just like, all right, let's just uh, ride out on the chorus. I'm wondering if that woman was the lady singing. I liked her voice. Uh, it's gonna be stuck in my head all day, so. <laughs> but it was a catchy song, good song. I'm gonna have to say not a banger on this one. Not a banger. Really good song though. Uh, the lyrics kept it back for me from being like a straight up banger. But that flute dancing around in the beat was so nice. The beat aged very well, man. It's, it's from 1993, this is like, that's catching me. Like, when I think of 93, I think of uh, 93 to infinity or Wu-Tang or something like that, you know what I'm saying? It's like, Way, back then, the beats weren't, uh, as the, the production wasn't as fresh as this one is. This had a sound that reminded me of uh, like, some, like that era of uh, popular music, like Smash Mouth and that type of stuff. <laughs> it seems like this could be on the Shrek soundtrack a little bit. <laughs> it's not even a diss. That's just, <laughs> just like that, that was what, early 2000s, uh, and that's the sound. So they're way ahead of their time. Props to them for that. 
and the video is really cool. I can see why this guy went on to do some uh, some more directing because he did a great job on this one. Glad I got to check it out. Thanks for the suggestion. Keep sending the suggestions, put them into the comments. I'll check them out, keep adding to the list. Thank y'all for being a part of this temple of consumption that is my channel, <laughs> my temple of consumption of Swedish classics. The next song I'll be consuming is Highwayman by Hof Maestro. So stay tuned for that. I think that might be another song in, in English, man. We're getting a lot of uh, songs I'm grabbing that happen to be uh, in English. So I think so, we'll see. Stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, get notifications, and most importantly, spread the word. Let people know about this American comedian living in Sweden, reacting to classic Swedish music. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next classic. Peace.